Hey guys, it's Kimberly here. I'm really excited about today's video because today I'm going to be talking about one of my favorite things ever. And if y'all know me, y'all know that is food, especially German food. I absolutely love German food. So yeah. So something that I've noticed while living in Germany and living in the US is that the American food culture is completely different than the German food culture. One of the m biggest things that I'm probably the most passionate about criticizing in the US is um, our food culture. We don't really have a very good food culture at all. Um, I'm probably gonna offend some people saying that, but it's true. Like. In America, we have a lot of good, tasty, palatable food. The food in America is either so salty or so sweet, which is really bad because when you eat something that's natural, you're just unsatisfied with it because you're used to eating very salty, very sweet foods. So with that being said is that I've noticed that America has a large group of picky eaters. And I think there's multiple factors for that. One being that the food in America is highly palatable for your taste buds. And two is the fact that Americans have so much food variety and food choice that they really have the opportunity to be picky. So these are kind of my two theories on why. With that being said, I wanna talk about my top five favorite German foods that might be considered a little bit strange in America and to be honest, I cannot picture most of my friends really liking or enjoying these foods and finding them kind of strange. Okay, so number one is the famous Metzbrötchen. Metzbrötchen is German raw pork that is grinded up and you usually get it in like a little, in a brötchen, um, which is like, it's like a bun and um, usually take off the top part and eat the bottom part and a lot of times it is served with onions and I really like it served with garlic and butter it's super good um, it is a breakfast staple in northern Germany um, so I love to have metbrochen with a cappuccino it's so delicious but I know that most of my friends in America are really horrified by that because they're very terrified that they would get salmonella, but that's a part of American history that I'm not gonna talk about here. But metbrochen is so good. Number two is white asparagus. So I didn't even know that white asparagus was really a thing. And I have been told by my boyfriend that white asparagus is white because um, it is underground and no sun hits it. And I just feel like that is hella German because there's never any sun here so the asparagus doesn't even get its tan here but white asparagus is super delicious I think um, the season for white asparagus is fall so a lot of Germans will make delicious meals out of it especially white asparagus soup is one of my most favorite things ever you can even get them at the grocery stores here it's not as good I really prefer it freshly made so number two white asparagus Super yummy. So number three is Tebus, and I'm gonna write it here because I probably just butchered the name, but Tewurst is apparently something that people used to eat back in the day, and they used to have it traditionally with tea. That's like why it has its name. It's a pretty common household food item, um, so it is really good, it's spreadable, and you put it on bread. I tried it out in one of my German words videos, so I'll catch that somewhere around here. Okay, number four. I'm actually not sure if this originated from Germany, but I can really picture it originating from Germany, and that is beer käse. So I tried it for the first time in one of my cheese videos, link it here, and I am obsessed. It is so delicious. I adore it. It's one of the more expensive cheese, cheeses, cheese to buy here in Germany. Um, but it's one of my favorite things ever. It's like one of the first things that I eat when I get to Germany. It's so good with some brot and I just love beer Okay, number five is roll mops. 
walnut. And actually I tried this for the first time on camera too in Bremen, so I will link that somewhere around here. But I absolutely love roll mops, roll mops. It is so, so lekka lekka. I've been told that I say lekka a lot, but it's one of my favorite words because I just love food. And roll mops is delicious. Roll mops is like a pickled fish and there's actually usually a pickle or gherkin in the middle of it and you have the little toothpick that I almost always bite into which is really dangerous. Weird but fun fact is that this northern German food is a good hangover cure apparently. I've never tried it but let me know if you've tried it because that would be great to know even though this year I'm doing a sober year. Hey guys, I hope you all enjoyed that video. If you enjoyed this sit down video, please let me know down in the comments below and post some video recommendations for me because I would like to start mixing in vlogs with sit down videos so that way I can get more content out there. And y'all know I'm not a late night person, but I'm staying up at 8 recording a video, so I'm dedicated to this. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I'll see y'all next week. Ciao, tschüss, bis dann.